Hello everybody and welcome back to F1 2007. Today we got China as our next race on this 10 race schedule. I will say right now that we have qualified an excellent P2 in a Toyota of all things. And um, yeah, it could it's shaping up to be a very good race, maybe a podium, maybe a win. But um, we shall see what happens. And also before we start this, I'd like to address something. I know many of you subscribe for Siege content and probably only Siege content and you're you know, you don't like the F1 stuff. And I just want to apologize, you know, I want to provide some variety on this channel, at least do something a little different because I'm it's not that I'm bored of Siege, but I want to at least try to do something different alongside that, you know, at least provide some optional content. You know, that I mean hence why I did the Ark Knights video the other day and such. And um, you know, it's fine if you don't watch the F1 stuff. I mean, I I recommend that maybe you watch it, maybe, you know, you'll like it, but it's all up to you. I'm not forcing any of you. But to those who actually enjoy the series, I thank you very much. Um, you know, my commentary is abysmal for the most part, but I try my best. I try my best to at least provide something in between the, you know, the laps and make sure it's not boring at least. But anyways, thank you for listening and let's get on with this race now. So our strategy, we go from softs to hards on lap, lap three. Wow, that's, I did not even know that. Anyways, 14 laps, I believe so. Yep, 14 laps, P2 on the grid. Let's see if we can make something happen. Light, lights out, there we go. We get a good start ahead of Raikkonen. We're gonna get him, we're gonna get, wow, we're actually gonna get the lead. Look at that. <laughs> My starts have been very good on this game, I must say. And I recently started to play more without traction control on here. You, oh, fuck. <laughs> I spoke a little too soon there. Oh, Raikkonen took it from us. But, I mean, before that mishap, uh, I was going to say, mainly I've been playing without the uh, traction control on this mod. Usually I play without traction control on, you know, the normal F1 games, but... Here it's been a little tricky, but I've actually gotten used to the handling of the cars after some good practice, so very good. Anyways, Raikkonen has re-passed us, as you saw. We'll try to get back at him. Hopefully this Toyota engine will provide us with power. And now onto the long ass straight here. There we go. <laughs> I wonder if Hamilton... Yep, he's catching up to us. <laughs> you got a midfield car like this up in the podium positions, but we're going to try our hardest to at least... Maybe see if we can hang with these guys at most. Man, that was so close. Trying for the switchback. I can see Hamilton. Yeah, he's trying for the switchback, and now he's right behind us. So is Massa. <laughs> We're blocking up Massa, and Hamilton has passed us. But. Oh, we get, that was a very good entry. There you go. See, this is why China is one of my best tracks. I can do stuff like that. And ha just in general, have great battles than the real life races. Even if we can't win, that's all right. I mean, hey, we're in P2 right now. Honestly, I don't know how Raikkonen's luck is going to be because if you haven't seen the past two episodes, uh, he's DNF'd out of both Bahrain and Australia. So <laughs> it's, I wonder if China will be the good luck charm this time for him. A new strategy is available. New strategy, AMSD. interesting. Lap three, lap four. I'll probably stick with the lap okay, three. Yeah, I'll stick with lap three. Once they have DRS, this might be all over, but I'm gonna try to hang on to this position as much as I can. Yeah, the, <laughs> the fucking Mercedes power, <laughs> please. <laughs> well, we could try and dive bomb down the inside. Yeah, let's do it. Kind of cut the corner a little bit there, but that's fine. It's whatever. Give him room, give him room. Oh, fuck. Just touched him a little bit. But we'll see if we can try and do the same thing as we did into turn one here, the last lap. We got a warning for colliding with him. We got the inside of line. We are going to do the same thing. I can... Uh, oh my god. 
I'm so good at this track. This I told you this is one of my best tracks. <laughs> it's so good. Especially with that first turn, I can just get the car planted right in there and just slip by them on the inside. And sometimes it's funny because you can like make the AI jump a little. Okay, clear. Oh, there's a caution. It's behind us though, thank the lord it's not Raikkonen this time around. <laughs> Might be one of the Red Bulls or the Williams. Safety oh, it's definitely one of the Red Bulls. Oh, safety car. And our pit window is open on this lap, so this could be good for us, I assume, hopefully. <laughs> okay, looking at- oh, looking at the race director, it was our teammate, Yarno Truly. I thought it was the Red Bull. My, my mind is still stuck in 2019 for some reason. It all looks like Raikkonen made his stop. So it looks like Jensen Button will be leading this race. Oh lord, come on. <laughs> Please. Oh, thank God. <laughs> I was worried that when that second Renault was coming behind us. Oh, looks like Lewis Hamilton lost out big time on that. <laughs> yeah, he did. Mark Webber's behind us now. Wow. I can't believe there's a safety car like this early on in the race. <laughs> and of course, it has to come from our teammate. But maybe it helped us. I don't know. We shall see what happens here once the safety car period is over. And now we have caught up behind. So Jensen Button, Nico Rosberg, Alexander Wirtz, and Rubens Barrichello are all the cars that haven't pitted yet. So Raikkonen is the one in front of us that has pitted and including myself and behind us. Those are cars on new tires as well. All right, come on, go, 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 come on. Okay, we got to jump on Raikkonen. Nope, no, we did not. There's four cards ahead of him, come on. Oh, can we get the inside advantage? Okay, oh, he didn't leave us room, right? Can him? why? <laughs> no. He's getting frustrated, you can tell. Yep, here we go. He's getting frustrated because <laughs> he wants them to get out of the way. Oh, shoot. Oh my god, I did not expect, I did not mean to do that, but... All right then. I meant to overtake Raikkonen, but hell, I'll take two. two I'll take a two-on-one pass. <laughs> oh my God, that was so freaking close! Goddamn, please, no. <laughs> we don't have the aerodynamics on the straight. Goddamn it! Look at Verts. Look at him. He's still trying to defend. He's like me. What what was that? <laughs> what are you doing? Catching Raikkonen again. But he, I, I expect him to really take the lead on this one because long straights coming up. That's where the Ferrari is very strong. Yep, and there he goes. Yep, there he goes. <laughs> Raikkonen is getting held up by Jensen Button as we overtake Rosberg. We're getting close to Raikkonen. Oh, but Rosberg's coming back. Where will he? He's trying to. Trying to do a crossover move on us. No, he won't get there. Good. Oh my god, how the hell did I get that? Oh my god, how? How? I was literally on the curb. I was sliding. Oh, Jensen Button is gonna pit, but here we are behind Raikkonen. Can we get past him though with DRS? It's still a little hard, but we we still got the first turn, though. Let's see what will happen here. Mm, sticking to that inside curve. There we go. Oh, we kind of surprised him a little bit there. See, I told you. <laughs> so our weakness point is that long straight, but pretty much anywhere else around the track is our advantage. Because we're good in the corners, but not on the straights, though. Nah, he's going to definitely overtake us. <laughs> Please. Spare us, Kimmy. Please. Ah, oh, there he goes. <laughs> we should be sticking with him though, because he kind of caught us. Yeah, he he caught us late on that back stretch. Hi, how are you? <laughs> Touched him a little with our rear. I am actually surprised that we're still battling with him because obviously in those that early stages of the race he was long gone and now kind of bunched us up again and now we're able to battle with him okay going on to this long back stretch now got a good exit out of that turn unlike the other laps that we 
did it, but I don't think it's going to be enough though because he's definitely going to have DRS. And obviously with that rocket powered Ferrari engine, <laughs> he's going to get us, but late into that backstretch. So we could actually go for a dive bomb. Yeah, we could go for a move inside there, side by side into this turn, give him room. There you go. You don't see people going wheel to wheel in that turn. Very interesting. <laughs> but he still got the advantage on us, but we'll have that turn advantage though. Turn one advantage, I should say. <laughs> yep, <Yeah>, every time. <laughs> his, his, his advantage is the straights, my advantage is the turns. And also, whilst we're battling, uh, the others have caught up to, the, to us, unfortunately. <laughs> Let's see what will happen this time around. We're gonna go way down the here. Oh, there's a caution. Track. Somebody's blown their engine or spun or something. Whilst Raikkonen, he's going to get us once again. And you see, you all have seen this before. We're gonna try to <laughs> reclaim that position. This time on the outside. And we're gonna get that advantage. There we go. First time up all day. Anyways, Kimmy's going for that move again. But <laughs> now we're gonna go for our signature move once again as well. The turn one surprise. The turn one surprise. <laughs> okay, we got a very good exit out of that turn. Damn. Better than, you know, all the other laps that we've done it. Obviously, Raikkonen is still going to catch us, but he's he's going to catch us actually late on this backstretch. Or will he? No, he won't. Wow, he's actually not even going to pass us. <laughs> Damn. Okay, we gotta start doing that more if we want to claim this elusive first win. We definitely got it. And now, the final lap starts. He's still gonna go after us on this straight. But we're gonna try to see if we can get him back into turn one. Uh, come on, come on, come on. There we go. And now it's a battle to the end. Oh, oh, shit. <laughs> okay, okay, never mind. I think we're fine. I think we're fine. I slipped up on that turn. Oh my god. But we shall see what's what it's gonna come down to on this last back stretch. We're gonna take we're gonna take that inside line. He's gonna try for the outside. I think we may have got it here. I think we may actually have got it. Oh my goodness. Yep, we got it. We got it. We got it. We're gonna come off the final turn here, and in our third start, we're gonna claim our first win at the Chinese Grand Prix. We win for Toyota, finally. That's a race win. You've really been great today. A hard-fought win today, then, after a very difficult race. And talk to me, what do you think it was that sealed the win for them? Well, the safety car completely changed the race, didn't it? It's hard to say exactly what would have happened without it, but there's no question that they came out of that situation in a good position. And it's time now for the podium celebrations, and how well-deserved is this one? This is a team all about giving talented young drivers an opportunity to race and to win. Alpha Tori are your winners here today. What a race. <laughs> what a race, man. From P2 and then, you know, we we got to P1. Kimmy and I were basically d distancing ourselves from the field. Like, my god. That safety car saved us, I guess you could say. Like, we got lucky because obviously in, before the safety car, he was miles ahead. And then the safety car bunched us up. And then we got stuck behind that uh, those back markers who basically didn't pit. And... <laughs> As a result, it led to that. But yeah, we're second in the standings now. 14 points behind Felipe Massa. Jumped up to third in the constructor standings. Very good. <laughs> All right. Well, <laughs> what? All I can, I'm speechless after that race. Like, I can't even speak. But what a race. It was in our third start. We already got a win. And for Toyota, too, who has actually never even won in F1 in real life so <laughs> it's actually it actually feels pretty damn good right now I can say right th I can say that so anyways if you enjoyed this episode of F1 2007 please make sure to drop a like and subscribe as always and I shall see you all next in Spain for the Spanish Grand Prix take care